Okay, let me look at these tweets. Wait, can I just go to the... Wait, let me find them before he delete them. Because you know when niggas start tweeting crazy, they're they going to delete the tweets. And I don't want to I I miss out. Wait, where does this tweet ride? I mean, where does this start? Oh, I guess right here. Oh, God. Oh, my fault. Don't know his R off. My bad. I don't know, but he reminds me of chewed gum. All right, bro. Did JPEG cook? Let me see. But when JPEG Mafia logs in and tells the truth, people want to get mad. Why? Because it's true. The truth hurts you bitches, and I'm going to keep bringing the pain. Album coming in 2024. Is this where it starts or no? New album too, by the way. I didn't know that. Okay, it's where it starts. Peggy, what'd you think of the Lou Nil? Lo <clears throat> he deleted? Oh, he deleted a bunch. Damn, that's crazy. I don't give a fuck. Okay, that's fair. That's a fair that's a fair assessment of the situation. I can't imagine how you feel when you perform at your own concerts. Why would I be mad at white people that are my fans and love me? I've always and will always love them. The rest of y'all are stupid, basic ass NPC, yeah. And you're not intelligent enough to understand nuance because your iPad raised you while your mother was whoa. What the fuck? What's the rest of it say? Deep dick by someone who looks like me. That's not true. They were Hispanic too. Uh, JPEG Mafia is the most terminally online rapper ever, tweeted by JPEG Mafia. Y'all think I could beat up MC Ride? No, I don't think any rapper alive can beat up MC Ride. This nigga got 80 niggas in a room and make a Backstreet Boys song. Facts. Niggas just standing around on stage. I mean, you a little late on that, though. Like, why'd you tweet about this today? Leave MC alone? No, I'm leaving him alone. I'm just saying, you know, I'm just saying. Niggas standing around the stage like your baby mama got fucked? Question mark. Ooh, mine too. Let's make a song. Men unite. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, that's funny. I'll just stop. Y'all ain't built like me. I don't actually want anything from none of these niggas. I just like to promo this way because most of y'all are too dumb and white to see it. I don't know why the white niggas just caught another stray. Your favorite rapper's kid got a dick tent in his head though and nothing can change. Wait, your favorite rapper's kid got a dick dent. Oh, dent. I thought he said tent. I'm like, wait, who's gay? Um, all right. The kid though. Why? Why the kid? Why the kid? Why the kid? I'm not here to make friends. I'm here to make money. Okay, that's fair. That's okay. He's speaking like yay. Nah, cause I think he actually mean this though. The deleted tweets were crazy. And if you got a problem with me saying, wait, okay, oldest to newest. Also, Kanye West, I respect you, but the way you acknowledge niggas who have less to offer you than me makes me feel a way. I'm a scientist in the lab, a surgeon, bruh. You and you skip over me for niggas that's getting their baby mamas fucked on camera. I want to make money. Fuck these niggas. No relevance whatsoever to his issue, to be honest. Um, you got 27 niggas tweaking hi-hats just to make some mid. Talk to a real scientist, brother. Stop wasting time. And if you got a problem with me saying that about your baby mama, do something about it. I'm in L.A. and don't run from no one. All right. Gets better than this bum, but the tweets were funny. I'm, I'm only confused because it's really like one of those situations where it's like, you need to fuck with a nigga like me. And it's like, nah, you, you, you don't actually want that JPEG mafia. You, you don't, you, you, you want to, I mean, not to say that you got to listen to people, but like based off of the shit that, you know, Kanye be on, I would like to think that you wouldn't want to be in close proximity making music with a nigga like that for real. It seems more, it, it, it seems to me more, or it comes off more as if you have a bigger issue with like not being invited to the party. You know what I'm saying? As opposed to like a genuine outside perspective looking in critique of the situation itself um, based off these tweets in the series of other shit, you know? I think it's because he's been trying to work with Kanye for a long ass minute. Yeah, so it just come off as bitter. 
if you'd have said this like when these situations happen and like obviously you know you got it but you know that's that's just how it come off bro not a not a great look you know but i agree like the music that jpeg mafia has be putting out or has been putting out the past couple years has been more impressive than anything that i've seen come from kanye's camp i'm gonna be honest with you in terms of creativity this is jpeg version of you ain't got he answers sway Kanye worked with BK to rule it before Peggy. <laughs> Wait, when did that happen? Wait, when, when was that? <laughs> Loki deleting tweet should be banned. Nah, it's a lot of shit that you say in the moment. You be like, yo, nah, chill, bro. I gotta relax. The way I have to work around white people's stupidity on a day-to-day -day basis is crazy. Just because you don't have a life doesn't mean I'm beefing with imaginary people. You're projecting white people are stupid as fuck, yo. Yo, where did these, uh... <laughs> then don't tweet kind of pussy for deleting? Yeah, I mean, I agree. I, I would just tell you to stand on it. Y'all think Kanye's best work is behind him? Yeah. 100%. 100%. But that's okay, that's okay. He's he's given a lot or enough to me for me musically. He don't I don't need to. Your cowboy is else all right in the chat. Lol. By the way, not for you, Sean. I forgot you don't like football, aka getting hit. What the fuck? Why are you putting it out there like that? I never said that. What the fuck? Kanye's washed. Uh, I wouldn't say Kanye's washed. I don't like saying nobody's washed, but i'm not looking forward to kanye shit at like at this juncture at this point you know what i'm saying he could really keep it to be honest to be honest because i won't be listening to that new one even though like i said it might have some ideas on there it's just like that rent just rubbed me the wrong way bro like it's just too you too deep in too deep in. I don't like the. I didn't like seeing niggas defend like the shit that he was saying, bro. Peggy's known for deleting tweets. He talked about it before. Yeah, I mean, I really think you should just not even tweet. You know, you should really save all this shit for your music, um, and then watch people talk about it as they may. But everybody got their own methods. Uh, you deleting it make it seem like you regret it, and it just make it seem like all right, well, air it out if that's how you really feel. That's how that's how I feel personally. Kanye been fucking around with trash artists because they're in some controversy or some hype. Yeah, but that's been Kanye. Kanye's been fucking with who he's been the last, like, couple years. So it's okay. I wouldn't want to be associated. Like, if, if I got... So here's the situation, right? I like to look at things like proximity and what people look at me as. So I knew I was doing something wrong one day when I made a video about Lizzo a long time ago. I think this was probably 2019. And um, I said something I don't think that it was in proper spirit. I think it probably came off mean spirited. And Adam 22 hit me up to do like a he said, like basically saying, like, if you in L.A., like hit me up, we should we should talk at some point. And I knew at that moment I did something wrong because when certain people are like consume, like when you hit the wrong audience or when you hit the wrong target, you know, all right, I fucked up somewhere. I fucked up somewhere around this around this time. And so I, I deleted the video immediately. Um, probably like within the next couple of days, I deleted it. And I was like, nah, I fucked up somewhere. I did. I did something wrong. And um, I think that's what this should be. Or this should be the bigger takeaway from this. If I'm not being requested or invited, there is a part of this that could be like niggas don't know who I am or they just not fucking with me. But I think another part of this is I don't even want this type of company. I don't want to be. Uh, uh, uh around this group of people to be honest with you like i think i'm good i think i'm blessed to be in my in my area in my circle working with who i'm working with and hopefully you know i can get two better positions or into those rooms you know what i'm saying just off the basis of my own skill and talent you know what i mean i definitely got jump scared when when that happened i'm like yeah nah i, I think i hit the wrong the wrong audience when i put this one out so let me go ahead and take this one down. i don't want i don't want this to be the uh audience and group of people that finds their mutual hatred of this particular person or these particular types of people through this video let me just i fucked up somewhere let me just chill out you feel me no i didn't respond am i gonna play horror games today uh yeah 
I hopefully. I don't know, bro. I'm scared. I don't want to play no shit. But I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna play a little bit. I'm gonna play a little bit. Do you want another weekend album? Yes. He teased something. Yes. And what's his best project? My fault. Huh? What happened? What happened? Notice how he said, "Come to LA, not let me go to Detroit." <laughs> Why the fuck would Adam Twenty Two go to Detroit? Holy shit! But I think that was at a no. Nah, that would have been crazy. No, that would have been awful. What the fuck are you trying to say? Get off my dick! Holy shit! I just realized what you said. God damn! Hop off!